After a long season of travelling up and down the continent, the moment is near. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined by Stuart Robson, as always on these special occasions for commentary. We're getting close to kickoff time in the UEFA Europa Conference League final. It is Aberdeen up against Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, Derek, what a final this should be. Both these sides have played some great football to get here. I just hope we see them at their best today. This should be a great game. So we can check on the lineup today. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And here's the starting 11 for Frankfurt. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3-4-3 formation without wing-backs, which means the outside centre-halves will need to cover the areas out wide, which I would say is asking a lot. And this confrontation is underway. The attacking options appear plentiful, but the danger averted for now. Well, no stopping him. Real chance. The opening goal in the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Are back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Ross McCrory now moving the ball impressively here this could level it Tremendously strong in the tackle. Max. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Clarkson. Good looking sequence. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Kamada. An unforced error, you've got to say. 
Well, Frankfurt haven't had that much of the ball so far, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. He's got to score! And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Short corner it is. A very timely interception. Graham Shinney. But a crucial intervention inside the box. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. And so the battle commences. Real chance. The opening goal. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Mario Goodson. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Goodson! And thwarting his opponents in the nick of time. Clarkson. And they could really get at the opposition. chance well it was caught nicely enough but the fact of the matter is it wasn't on target Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Ndika. Jesper Lindström. Kono Muani. It is a decent looking attack here. And using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Well, no luck keeping possession. Graham Shinney. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Puta. Buta with it. Gibril So. Chance to do damage. Good play it in. It did look on for them, but not to be. Oh. 
on the ball in an attacking position but they've got to do something positive quickly Kamada here's Gutsu now so Aurelio Buta ball with Makoto Hasebe Ndika Hasebe Gibril so well that is how to nullify the opposition and there goes the final whistle the cup issue is settled a story of one side celebrating and the other distraught memories are being made well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity.